Babe, you know what? What? <laughs> what? We've been married like nine months now. Ah, what? So, what do you think so far? I think it's been your pleasure and I can't wait for 900,000 more years with you. Or 900,000 more months or something. Forever is what I'm trying to say. I'm ready for forever. Good. Because you have no choice at this point. Yeah, and what about you? How do you feel? It's been cool. It's been good. I learned that I actually like Max. After marriage, I still like him. You know how it usually goes like this? It's only been going up. Yeah, you don't, you don't get on my nerves as much as I thought you would. <laughs> but you get on mine. <laughs> but, um... Choose your words wisely, okay? No, I, I, I truly enjoy. It's been, it's been cool. It's been cool. It's going to be cool. And it's not even a year yet. What are we going to do for our one year oh, anniversary? I don't know. I'm so excited, man. I'm, I, you know, I, I'm very excited about all the stages of life with you. Like we spent, um, what is it? Independence Day together? I never celebrate Independence Day, but I'm like, it's our first Independence Day together. Let's celebrate. And he's like, what? I'm like, <laughs> well, the reason why it made sense is because we had that out, brand new outdoor kitchen. Yes. And we wanted, I think it's like our first time grilling out there. Yeah, like Something the whole like the whole family yeah, came whole down family. and we were like grilling and it's been a process making this house a home and so it's really cool when we have family over and we can grill and we all spend time and create memories here. It's so beautiful. I'm getting very emotional. But it's not it's not done yet. There's still so much things to be done. We're working with Sumfi. Sumfi is hooking us up with some dope blinds. So first of all, this house is like a smart house. But it's not done yet. It's like one of the last things. That and landscaping. So we live on 20 smart acres. like us. Yeah. It has to be modeled after us. So it's a very smart home where you can set settings and do things and talk to it. It's not done yet, but um, it's going to be done this month, inshallah. Inshallah, we'll, we'll man. Be, we'll be done with that. And then we can live comfortably and travel. I know we're going to... No, but back to the house. Sorry. We are the blinds. I'm excited about that. The shades. I should say the shades. Yes, the shades. You know, I never uh, notice things about households until I move. Because you can look. Like, there's no shades on the windows. But luckily, we live where nobody can, like, watch. And I didn't know how popular Sumfi was until we started going to all the major hotels and finding Sumfi. And now I'm super excited for them to come to the house and hook it up here. So they're going to finish with Sumfi. We have Control 4, which runs the entire house. I don't want to bore you with this stuff because I'm a tech nerd. He but is. the house is gonna be like voice activated so you can do certain things by command. But we can't wait for that. I think that's gonna be cool. At least somebody around here will be able to listen to me. And not complain. Uh-huh. So not I'm bad. excited. <laughs> Shade. <laughs> Since we're celebrating nine months, why don't we go show- Are we celebrating it? Yes, okay. we celebrate everything, okay? Okay, okay everything is a celebration. We should go and watch our wedding video. What do you think? And like commentate on it. It's been a month. Well, we've, it's been a we've while. never showed the wedding video. The, not the whole thing. We have a short version. Yes. That's like a, we'll, we'll, let's watch that. We should do that. Yeah. And then you guys get to see it for the first time. And we get to relive it and say how we feel now. You know, really, when you're in the moment and you're in your own wedding, things don't really hit you and things process later. So I'm really excited to like watch the wedding video and, and notice new things and... We'll watch the short version because the long version is like an hour long. You sure you don't want to watch the long we did. version? Remember we watched it when we first got back? I want to watch it again. For YouTube purposes, we won't, watch, we won't bore you guys with the whole wedding, but we'll show you like the cool abbreviated version. But how about this? Like if they like the short version. Maybe we do the long version. Yes. Please okay. comment below just for self-satisfaction. If you guys want to see the full wedding, let us know. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's, let's go. go watch the wedding. Welcome to my podcast room. You guys are allowed. Please enter the Maze Vault podcast room. Okay. Okay, Google, turn the lights on. This is my favorite part of the room. This is like a grass background with my podcast name. But hold on, let me, let me, how about you do the tour since you... <laughs> All right, since you really don't know what you're talking about, let me show you, <laughs> you guys, the podcast room. So May was away visiting her family for the weekend, and myself and Matt decided to 
make her a podcast room because she was talking about a podcast. So I have my own studio in behind, another building behind the house. So I want to give her her own space to do it. So if you look around, the first thing you want to do is create a accent wall. So we got these, Amazon, all Amazon. And then we ordered this beautiful maze vault neon sign. I don't remember the name of the company. So you see this stuff here, cool stuff from Amazon, ordered a dope neon sign, and uh, that's pretty much it. Now look at, if you look at these, these are sound panelings. So these have like a uh, sound dense thing in there, I don't know what it's called. But we made these from scratch. I'm not the best handyman, but we got it done. So they're placed all over the room just so that it absorbs the sound so it doesn't just echo all over the place. May picked out this, this, uh, what is, what is it? It's a lamp of a person thinking, because I'm a thinker. Right. <laughs> and so we got a couple chairs. Um, didn't know which ones to pick. This one ended up being pretty cool. We got this desktop. We got this, the top of this from Home Depot. And then I stained it so it looked good. And then I put it on one of those desks that go up and down. So this thing can go up and down, even though she's never used it like that. And then the most important thing you need, one of the most important things you need, for any video, or just a video podcast, is a light. So we have a nice soft box with a, a uh, Godox box, a light kit back there. Makes her bright. You have a Sony uh, A7S III with a teleprompter. And the reason why you need a teleprompter is not to read stuff, but it's because she does a lot of Zoom meetings and this allows her to look directly into the camera and not off to the side. I don't want to bore you with everything, but she has a roadcaster podcaster thing there and a cool uh, pod mic so she can do her podcast and she's had some amazing guests so far and I think it's going to be awesome. What do you what do you think? Give me this. What do you think about I mean, I'm not a techie like you, but every time I hop on a Zoom or I have like a collaboration and I use this room, people are really impressed with the quality of the sound and the quality of the video that we have in this room. So I think if you're gonna start your own podcast, like this is a very good go-to. Um, we like, like even little things like this add a super cool touch and like speak on my personality and like the way you set everything What's up. What's that so plaque? This is for 1 million. I'm waiting for my second plaque because I hit 2 million on TikTok. Woo! Thanks to you guys. And then I have like books that I need to start reading soon. <laughs> need to. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> and can I show them this really cool sign? Um, this one right here. I gotta turn it on. Once you enter this room, good vibes, uh, good vibes only. Should I turn this on? Yeah. Wow. So, Ready for Hollywood. So that's the bright light. That's the desk. And this is the view that most people see. Is that view? That's the view. <laughs> the best view. <laughs> Alright, cool. So let's 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 watch our let's watch our yes. video. Okay. Uh, <coughs> here's a, here's a chair. I'm so excited. Which one do you want? Cause I have two. The one with the bigger butt. That's yours. Yeah. You definitely have a bigger butt. <laughs> Comfortable. All right, you guys, so we are going to jump into the computer, watch this video so that you can, we can reminisce our nine months and you get to watch some of the wedding footage that I don't think is out there. It's unless not. you were at the wedding, some people have some footage out Yes, but. oh, I'm so excited. And a lot of people are like, I wonder what an Egyptian Jamaican wedding is like. I wonder what it's like. We're about to show you the juice because it was really lit. Yeah, so let's watch it, let's go. Okay, so we're here at the setup of the podcast room and now it's time to watch our wedding video. Since it is our nine month, anniversary, no, it's not. Anniversary, anni a celebration. Yeah, celebration, like it's it's anniversary means annual. Oh. So it's just a nine month celebration. Celebration. We decided to watch this video and you get to watch it with us for the first time. We've seen it before, but you haven't seen it. So we're gonna actually do some commentary on the video. Bring back some Remy's for us. Just refresh yes. our... And our... say what's really on your mind. I am. Always do. All right, let's check it out. Oh, you went so in some. That was As believers, super as cold, but we genuinely believe it looked awesome. That enjoying life doesn't happen when we're back. Mufti Rafiq, the only guy that I would have do this ceremony again. He was amazing. 
understood everything he was saying. This center, this place we did our wedding at, was, it was amazing. It was at a reasonable, reasonably priced, um, and it was just amazing. Oh my god. Look at that setup. Shout out to Ruby Events, she did that. Oh, you see that? See that? <laughs> Forgot about that, huh? <laughs> Why you didn't use those dance moves later with your dad? Whenever you're extremely happy, don't look at her family. Relax, take it easy. After a couple days, make a decision. A lot of people ask us, how do our families get along? Well, they get along pretty well. They mesh, yeah. They're like besties that never met before. Yeah. This napkin. That love between you increase every single day. We ask Allah that He protect both of you. We ask so Allah cute. that whatever steps you guys take, you take. Look at that! Oh my God, the floor, the smoke. So that smoke was is what is it? Ice, dry ice. They have a machine for this, but it was it was just like a whole dream. Hey, hey, yeah. Second dress, second dress. If you have two those. dresses, people got two phones. I got two dresses. <laughs> Oh, the Zephyr. So let Pauses. me. We we have to pause here for a second because the first look is supposed to reveal my beautiful bride for the first time in that dress. Unfortunately, <laughs> being married to her, the first reveal was her brother. I was so excited to see her when uh, for the first time, and then I turn around and it's this guy in a. Oh my okay, goodness. listen, I was planning this for like a month, a month and a half, and I was really excited, but I was very nervous because I was like, oh my God, I could kind of ruin the moment, but this is so good that I couldn't help myself. And so this happened and he had no idea because he would talk about how like during the first look, he's so <clears> excited <throat> and he's going to feel very emotional and cry. And so I'm like, damn, did I take away that crying moment? Because you didn't cry. You didn't cry at the wedding and I still am mad about that. <laughs> Well, this was my but then I, I set it, I set him up a little bit. You set me up. I set him up. I was throwing snowballs at him. <laughs> my sister. My more fat. <laughs> so surreal, man. Abdul Al, the daughter of brother Nabil Abdul Al. I got this beautiful dress from Qatar. Max Maxwell. The son of Desmond Winter And you look and very sharp, sir. Thank you, ma'am. As you look Brother mighty Maxwell, fine yourself. The son of <laughs> Desmond Winter. Do you accept Sister May Abdul Al, the daughter of Brother Nabi? Look at my wife. Jumping. <laughs> and so at this point, they have asked me three times, I think is normal. Four, four times. But they asked me four times to make sure I was sure because they were very adamant. My mother was very adamant. My wife finally said, no refund policy. <laughs> Once she is gone, I, she is gone. Dude, I was getting so mad. I'm like, uh, who is setting me up? I, like, my own family is against me. They're like, Max, no return policy. My own father leans in and he's like, this is your last chance. <laughs> After this, you are done. <laughs> but it was so cool. Look at our beautiful families uh, there just having fun. And Everybody's so happy. It was amazing. It was amazing. <laughs> This is the real reveal. So if you see, I don't want to turn around because I don't know if it's a prank again. Wow. Oh, but man, she is so brother. beautiful that day. Way better than your brother. Oh, I was so nervous. <laughs> He's clenching his teeth from the cold because this is a January wedding. You're like, it's good. It was it's good. very cold that day. Very cold. We are beholding. Oh, I tried not to cry like four times during the, the nikah, the religious ceremony. Unreservedly, wish the newlywed well. Hey, hey, hey. More fat. Sheila, break it down. We had, we had. Dope Egyptian music, dope Arab music, we had Jamaican music, we had Bob, we had everything. It was just an amazing time. Everybody knew every song. We were having so much fun. Everybody was breaking it down to every everything. All we needed was a beat. <laughs> oh, wow. You know what 
I love, our, our wedding was small, intimate, but everybody that was there was truly like happy for us. Yeah. Ah! A kiss. <laughs> okay, I was dreading the kiss because PDA is illegal, <laughs> okay, even on your wedding day. And so the photographer kept going, oh, you have to get Max, you have to, it's for the phone, he kept pressuring. And I, all I could picture is my mom and dad who raised me as, <laughs> watching us kiss, but we did it. And I was like. <laughs> we got it done, we moved on. It was fun though, I mean, the whole wedding was amazing. There was some special people that kind of helped move along. I was pretty much hands off, I won't lie. She, yeah, we we planned this. She planned this wedding in two months with the help of her family and some other friends. And who, like, the dude, let me tell you, if I didn't have these people on my corner, there was no way this wedding would have turned out as beautiful as it did. OK, first of all, shout out to DJ Zenzoon because she was not only a DJ, but she was a wedding planner. And I had called a bunch of wedding planners. But she literally, she's been doing this so long that she hires everybody that you need to hire. And she went above and beyond like just being a DJ. She was literally like my right hand woman. And not only that, anytime that we like submitted, you you called somebody or inquired and they looked up our name, the oh. prices went crazy. So these people were very reasonable priced and they did went above and beyond and, and it was a lot, even more like the, yes. the wedding photographer, the, the, the Okay, video. so Manthe Studios did our photography and video videography. Mm -hmm. Amazing job, worth every single penny. I had a bridal attendant, her name is Emna. I'm gonna tag her below because she was phenomenal. A bridal attendant is like your assistant for the day who helps you lift your dress, go down, bring you water, anything you guys need, mm -hmm. anything we both need during the wedding. She was like, uh, telling people to back off when we were tired, just literally like your right hand woman the whole day. She was above and beyond as well with her service. And then Ruby Events, she's the one who did the flowers and the decor for the wedding. Okay, that's the ma a major major part of your wedding, and it was like a big stress. Okay, I was gonna have like me, I didn't. Yeah, know. obviously <laughs> you were hands up. Max, like just do whatever you want, just do whatever you want. I would like hit him up and be like. Uh, do you like this color? Do you like these flowers? It's like, just do whatever you want. <laughs> be like, oh. But anyways, like she was phenomenal and she was very reasonably priced. And makeup artist, Crystal, phenomenal. Everybody loves her. Those were like the main people that had the wedding flow so nicely. And oh, like- Kunefa cups at the end. For oh, the, yeah. A party favor for the wedding favors. Yes. So a lot of people do wedding favors that are like, that get thrown out or, or how, did not. You, how did you pick that though because you know i i love kunefa cups you love kunefa cups we're obsessed with kunefa and i think like it would be something that every guest enjoys and it's not something that gets thrown out so they did everybody a, took one home so that they or could, more than one yeah, i know who you are, yeah, know who you are. <laughs> so they took some home so the next morning they ate them you know when they had breakfast or something like that yes. or the next day some way sometime it's like cup you heat it up you put the uh, syrup. Uh, oh, okay sorry. okay i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm getting lost but yeah they did the wedding favor she did the wedding favors for us and that was amazing and it was like a team of people who really made our wedding a beautiful night that we will never forget uh, it was amazing and uh congrats to our nine months cheers Cheers. Cheers. So, no, congrats to our, our, <laughs> our nine months. And I know we got a long way to go. Nine months is, is very early, but... Even in the next life, okay? You're stuck. Yeah. Hey! Yeah, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm here. But look, we promised to put out way more videos on this YouTube channel. As things have been very busy, she's been doing things on her uh, YouTube, her new podcast. And he and has a podcast, and we're always all over the place, but I, I really want us to focus and go through this journey of life with you guys and continuously drop more content. If you guys like the snippets that you saw, okay, I want a little boost <clears throat> so that we can share the full wedding, because I feel like- you share the whole thing? Yes, because the partying was there. It was so, we had a lot of entertainment. We it, had a lot of things It's over happening. an hour long, so the video they put together <laughs> over hour long so if you want to watch it and you comment enough then i guess we could do it there was a lot of love and a lot of partying okay so I, if you guys want just let me know and i'm more than willing okay it's not it's just more than willing <laughs> and i want to say that watching the wedding video and watching that man i married nine months ago i'm very excited i am too. and i'm so happy that we took that decision made that decision we, we, we yes we made that decision thank you for correcting my english Ha, ha, ha.
<laughs> and yes, I'm excited for more content and more um, adventures with you. Yeah, so comment below if you want to see the whole video. Like if you haven't and subscribe if you're not. We really appreciate it. Don't forget to go follow her and I on socials all over yes, the place. Yes, we're um, everywhere. We'll keep we'll keep dropping more content. Dubai, we're coming. Coming soon. I'm so excited for that. And yeah, we should do some travel vlogs, huh? Absolutely. Yeah. All right, guys. We're out. Bye. Peace.